Hi, today is Saturday, March 20th, and I am so excited that it is the first day of spring here in the Northern Hemisphere. It's actually been snowing a little on and off today where I live, but I have been in a very springy mood, so I can't wait to jump into this haul because I have a few items from the Easter collection as well as from the garden collection. So I actually have two boxes here. I did place an order the day that the garden collection released, and then I also also closed out a party. So I have a lot of goodies here that are getting me in that springy mood. So let me go ahead and unbox the first box and I will show you what I got. All right. So I did pick up a few bundles. The first one is the moisture medley bundle. And I was really excited to get this because I've actually never picked it up before. It comes with a body wash, a hand soap, a body cream, and a hand cream. And you know that I've been on kind of an aloe water and cucumber kick. So I did have to pick it up in the body wash as well as the hand soap. I have been loving aloe water and cucumber wax in my bathroom, so I thought the hand soap would be perfect. And then I think my husband will really like the body wash, so I'm very excited to give those a try. And for the body cream, I decided to go with watermelon tangerine. So I already have this in the fragrance mist and absolutely love it. This is just a perfect kind of bright, sweet, perfumey watermelon. Love it. The notes on this are watermelon slices, juicy tangerine, and dewy greens. And I think it's that dewy green note that gives it just a little hint of kind of a sophisticated perfuminess. Mm, I love it. It is perfect for the spring and summer. So I'm very excited to have this in the body cream. And then I decided to go with pink cotton for the hand cream. I've heard a lot of good things about the pink cotton hand cream. The notes on this are clean cotton, pink berries, and vanilla sugar. And this is so nice. This is one of my favorite scents. I love it in the body wash. So I'm very excited to try it in the hand cream. Sometimes it kind of reminds me of a red cream soda type scent, um, especially I found in the body care products. So definitely one of my favorite scents. So the other bundle I picked up is a three washer whiffs bundle. And I decided to get some scents that I haven't tried before. So you know, I had to try aloe water and cucumber. And then I also tried out two of the newer scents. So I did pick up a windowsill breeze and this was a very strong scent in the wax, very strong kind of cotton laundry scent. So I figured this would be a really good one in the laundry. Oh yes, <laughs> I think that will be really, really nice in the washer whiffs. It smells like it'll be really, really strong. So I can't wait to give that one a try. And then I did pick up Palm Beach Breeze. So this was a wax in the summer collection last year. My husband actually really liked it. I didn't like it as much in the wax, but I did want to give it a try in the washer whiffs. Ooh, and I actually really like this scent in the washer whiffs. I thought the wax kind of smelled like hairspray, but this actually smells really pleasant. And I think that my husband will really like this one too. This just smells kind of bright and fruity. Um, I'm excited to try that one. And then I did pick up another dish soap in Fiesta Lime. I got this in the Whiff Box for March and my husband and I have fallen in love with it. So I did want to get another one of those. And then I had to get the matching counter clean in Fiesta Lime. This is just a very kind of bright, zesty, sweet lime scent. It smells kind of like a lime gummy and I love it. So excited to have those. And then I needed a new fragrance flower for my bathroom. So I picked this one up in aloe water and cucumber. This is the buttercup bell design. So I'm really excited to try this one. I think it'll probably be a good performer. The one that I have in my bathroom right now is Cozy Cardigan and it is almost done. So I think I'm going to get this one out just to smell the oil because I am really, really excited to try this one. Of course, I am loving all things aloe water and cucumber. Let me see if I can get this open. All right. Ooh, this smells really, really good. And this smells like it should be a pretty strong performer too. So I am really excited to put that one in my bathroom. And here is the buttercup 
shell design. So I really like this one. I like that this one has a little bit bigger petals. I don't know if that makes it a better performer, but I really do like the look of that. And then the last thing in this box that I am so excited for was kind of a spur of the moment thing that I used some of my rewards on and I can't wait to see it. So this is a diffuser shade in Enrich and I was needing one for spring. I have um, a pink one, but I thought this one would match my bedroom so perfectly. And like I said, I'm kind of in a springy mood. So I'm so excited to see what this one looks like. Oh my gosh. Oh, so pretty. So I do have my bedroom decorated with these kind of light aqua colors and oh I think that is so pretty. So it is that kind of mosaic look. The light just reflects off of all those little glass pieces. So I think that should be so pretty. I love that the colors are kind of varying too. Oh my gosh that is Stunning. So I can't wait to put this in my bedroom for the spring. I am going to put it in right after I film this video. So that was everything from the first box. Let me unbox the second box and I will be right back. Okay, so there are only a few things in the second box. I should let you know that I also got the Life's a Garden wax collection in that last box. I had to rip into that as soon as I got that so that I could do a video and get warming those scents, which are all really, really nice so that was part of that last box in this box I just have a few items so I did have to pick up one of the Easter bitty buddies and I got the lamb um, this is scented in rainbow sherbet one of my favorite scents so I had to see what this little guy looked like oh it's so cute so I love that the fabric is kind of this watercolor tie-dye look the lamb is pink the little bunny was blue and the little chick was yellow so i just thought those were so cute this smells really really good it really does smell like rainbow sherbet just very fruity and bright and zesty so i thought that that was really really cute and then i also picked up the moana scent so i haven't smelled this yet so i'm really excited to give it a try Ooh, so a little light on the top, but really pretty. It does smell kind of fruity and tropical. A little floral and perfumey too. It actually smells really, really pretty. Oh, it kind of reminds me of something that we've had before. Hmm, so I'll have to think about that, but I actually really like this. It does smell like it might be a little on the lighter side, but very pretty nonetheless. So very excited to try that. And then what I am really, really excited for is the Happy Herbitat Warmer from the Life's a Garden Collection. I have the Lavender Love Mini Warmer. So when I saw this, I knew that I had to get it. So let me unbox this really quick. All right, here it is. And oh my gosh. This is beautiful. So it has the same kind of shiny crackled finish that the Lavender Love Mini does. And it has those imprints of the lavender sprigs as well as a few extra little sprigs down here. Um, and this one does have some brown incorporated. So it looks like the stems are brown and then the lavender is that kind of deep egg eggplant color but oh, really, really pretty. I am so excited to plug this in and see what it looks like lit up. I also wanted to grab the Lavender Love Mini Warmer so that you could see them next to each other. They match perfectly and I am so excited to have this pair. I think I'm going to keep them both in this room. So, so, so pretty. I'm so happy that I picked this up. I would love to know what you picked up from the Easter or garden collection, what you are most excited for. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned and I will show you what this warmer looks like lit up. 
Okay, first I did want to show you this new diffuser shade. So this is the one that I've been using for the winter. I really, really like it. It reminds me of a cable knit sweater. So love that one. But I am so excited to use this one for the spring. Oh my gosh, that is beautiful. The colors really show up much better with the light coming through. You get some kind of shades of peach and gray, and then that's a really pretty kind of aqua color. So let's see the other colors. So the camera kind of does funny things to the light, but here are all the different colors. This is such a pretty diffuser shade. I am going to love it for the spring and summer. So I am really happy. I picked it up. All right, and here is the Happy Herbitat Warmer on. So very, very pretty. It gives off a really nice glow. You can see a little bit of that crackle finish. And then I really like that it has the holes in the back that kind of cast light onto the wall. But I am really, really pleased with this warmer. I think it is beautiful. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.